I've been staring this project to where it is today for the last seven or eight months and I'm very pleased that we now have an MOU with the government. This project is really very different to everything that Belize has right now. Um, first of all, it's going to make it possible for Belize to access the very larger ships, or I should say for the very larger ships to access Belize. And the ships today are getting larger and larger and larger, in excess of 6,500 passengers. Um, so those ships can access this port. Uh, secondly, tendering will not be necessary, and that's highly desirable by the cruise lines. Uh, third, uh, it will not be necessary to dispatch hundreds of tour buses through the very narrow streets of Belize City. And, and that's a very positive development. Uh, and of course, the employment opportunities are much greater than anything else I've seen. And the economic benefit is going to be much more significant. OK, now, beyond the MOU, um, where is this project in terms of uh, planning, development, should we see construction starting anytime soon, um, and what's the timeline for completion? Well, let, let me say that we have backing from many banking sectors, uh, the local sector as well as international sectors. We have the support of the cruise lines. Uh, they, for the last 15 years, have wanted to see something like this. Uh, we've not completed our EIA yet. That is the next step. Uh, but if all goes according to plan, I would expect us to commence construction in the early part of next year.